Carly Snow here with Nail's Next Top Nail Artist, and this is challenge number five. The sponsor is Easy Flow. The title is World of Wonders. So for my world wonder, I chose to go with the Taj Mahal. I kind of have never heard of it before this, but I was just thrown away with the details and the beauty and some of the artwork on this piece. So the Taj Mahal was built because the Emperor Shah Jahan in 1631 wanted to mem commemorate his favorite wife who died giving birth to her 14th child. So getting started on these nails, I did a little ombre effect of some candy floss color and the warm pink and white acrylic from Easy Flow. Then I started to do a little portrait of Emperor Shan Jahan's wife, and her name was Mumtaz Mahal, um, hence the name, the Taj Mahal. So I sketched out kind of like an outline of where I wanted her face to be, and then I started shading in the facial features using two different colors of skin color to create shadow shading in the face. And then went back in with a very fine brush and some gel art paint and made the little details in her jewelry and outfit, which these people are decked out. They have the coolest styles. Then getting started on making the actual Taj Mahal, I started out by making a line across all the nails just to keep a reference for where my horizon is and using a sculpture form I covered up one tip while I held the other one next to it so I could make this shape hanging over the other nail without being attached to it you'll see later and then I went in with making the little side pillars to the Taj Mahal of um, using some different gold colors because if you read about the um monument it says that it seemingly changes colors according to the sun so i wanted to have some like sunset vibes going on on the shading of my building and i did the same thing with the sculpture forms on the other tip kind of so those could fit together like a puzzle piece but they're not really attached I added some detail in the arches on some of the pillars and I went and made the little tiny like wall slash steps up to the monument and I did the same ombre effect that I did on the top of the building with the gold to white to pink then added on by hand painting some detail and making recreating the brick which actually it's like marble brick this whole building is made out of white marble it's quite amazing it said it took over 20,000 people to make it and it took like what almost 20 years to complete so there is a little pond um, in front of the monument which every time there's like a picture taken of it, it perfectly reflects the Taj Mahal upside down into it. So I wanted to create that reflection. And then I added on some detailing um, that was actually on the monument itself. This thing is covered in these little tiny details like this, but I used gel polish and then buried it in clear acrylic powder to create an embossed effect um, or like sugared effect. It kind of just made it stand out on the glossy um, top coat, having that matte puffed up detailed design. And on my pieces of the building that move away, I created some of that scrolling detail 
just so there's something extra there when you pull them apart. This is my Taj Mahal in remembrance of Mum Taj Mahal. Thank you guys so much for watching.